Welcome, in this video I want to perform a gaming test and also share some performance tips and tricks for Galaxy Tab A11. So let's start with uh, tips and tricks. Uh, since the A11 tablet is uh, not like a gaming ta uh, tablet and uh, it doesn't have a game booster, a Samsung game, a native game booster installed on it. It's not uh, particularly clear how to boost your ga game performance on this tablet, but uh, there are pretty uh, a couple of pretty quick things that you can do to improve your device's uh, uh, performance in games. Uh, so what you have to do is open settings and to find the device care first. Now in the device care, uh, not only you can uh, optimize your device by the op optimize now uh, icon that usually appears right here, but it seems that my de my device is already optimized. Uh, now also check for software update. Of course, uh, before you check for a software update, make sure that you either have any Wi-Fi or any or mobile data connection. Uh, click download and install and make sure that there are, uh, that your software is up to date. If it's not, take your time and update your software. It's always good to keep your firmware in touch if, with your hardware. Uh, once you do that, now we can also unlock some you know, more hidden uh, performance uh, tricks by going to about tablets and unlocking the developer mode by uh, going to we, we are looking for build number. Uh, let's uh, let's ch check right here. No. Oh, in software information, we have the build number. Tap on it seven times, and tap OK. Now let's go to the developer options. And in developer options, well, I'm not gonna scroll through all of this uh, stuff. Uh, I don't. Let's not torture ourselves. Uh, instead, a search for uh, animation scales. Oh, like and tap tap on transition animation scale. That doesn't matter which one. Uh, and so now, what we're looking for is the is the windows uh, window animation scale, transition animation scale, and uh, the the last one. Well, what we have to do is change it to 0.5x. This will uh, improve the transition speed on the tablet. And also, let's limit the background apps that can run in order to uh, free up some RAM uh, memory on, on the laptop. So look for the background and just let's just scroll until we find developer options. And uh, uh, here we have uh, background processes limit. And let's set this limit from the standard one to at most three processes, because I, I think that's that will be enough. And uh, okay, and uh, at this point everything should be fine. So manually uh, close the tabs, uh, the apps that you have running in the background, and uh, then open your Gaming Hub, I, I recommend using it as it is the native uh, application for games on, on your tablet. Uh, e even if there, uh, I mean, I mean, even uh, uh, even without a game uh, booster, uh, it still is a native application. So I consider it the best option to download your games to on your tablet. So let's test uh, this uh, tablet's performance right now in the uh, PUBG. PUBG Mobile. <laughs> Let me start the game. Okay, so here you can see what it looks like. Let's close all the tabs. Uh, that's what games uh, game feels like. Uh, let me also show you the settings of the game. Uh, statistics is not what I'm looking for. Uh, here. Settings, uh, graphics. Uh, so as you can see, we have better graphics uh, set up. HDR, uh, Ultra HDR isn't available on this tablet. So HDR and uh, here are the rest of the settings. Now let me start a quick match. I don't need, no. Fail arena. Hmm. 
give a moment. Okay, so right now I'm I'm waiting for the game. Uh, Why did I get transferred back? Uh, okay, so let me start the match basically, and then I get back to uh, right to. Okay, so now you can check the game performance for yourself. Well, in my opinion, for HDR settings, uh, this game runs pretty smoothly on the tablet. Fifteen seconds. I have funny, funny ghosts running around me. They're flying around me, I think. Okay, so, okay, uh, we're starting now. Uh, <laughs> I have unfortunate news for my uh, bodies, uh, game bodies. Uh, I need to die as soon as possible in this game. Okay, I'm not sure if I can. What if, if I have unfollow? I can jump wherever I want. Okay, let's let's jump right now. Uh, I just want to find some other players around me. I don't see, I don't see anyone jumping around me. That's unfortunate. But as you can see, the game runs very smooth. Uh, the texture loading uh, speed is not perfect, but uh, I I'm not sure if if that's something uh, if that's something players already expect from uh, mobile gaming. Um, I w I wish I w I wish I was uh, more uh, invested in, into the topic. Okay. So let's look for other players. No, I think I think uh, I actually I think that this was a bad idea to just jump right here. So I don't see anyone. I see one of my teammates there running there. But I was hoping for enemies. Okay, so let me also adjust the brightness because I, I I feel like 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 it's just too dark. It looks too dark to you know, it doesn't. It? So generally speaking, uh, you can see everything for yourself. The game runs pretty smoothly. Uh, all the animations, uh, everything. So let me just finish this game and then we'll return, uh, I'll return back in the second game I wanted to test on this device, which is the Asphalt Legends. Okay, so now let me turn to the Asphalt, uh, the Asphalt Legends. Let's check the settings, game settings, and let me show you the graphics that I'm currently using. Uh, so visual quality is uh, custom, but it's uh, like the most... Uh, advanced gra graphics uh, that I could have possibly set in this game so base profile is high quality, bloom high, depth of field is also high and everything else is either high or ultra the frame rate is set to 60 so now let me just press play let's choose some match okay let's choose this one let's play next let's choose a car and let's start a run or the race. Okay. So honestly, I don't I don't know how to control the car in this game. Um, I don't even know if I'm controlling it in any way. Um, 
think it controls itself, but it does, that's even better for me, I think. Okay, so let's use some nitro. Nitro. Uh, and generally, let's take a look at the graphics. I'm not sure why why that uh, textures are uh, are so you know s uh, spiky. Why why aren't they s uh, why didn't they s uh, smoothen them? But but generally they look they look uh, manageable. And uh, these are the best available settings in this game. And they run pretty smooth. Uh, like the game runs pretty smoothly, as you can see for yourself. So, I think I think that that uh, it makes it. Uh, so you just saw everything for yourself. Now you know how to improve gaming performance and how to easily play play your game with the highest possible settings with. Uh, uh, so like so smoothly and uh, without no any problems on this particular tablet. I hope that you liked this video and if you did, please consider subscribing to our channel, leave us a like in the comment below and I'll see you in the next one.